morning vloggers. Today we're going to be doing some cut and polish on the roof of my Ford Explorer 1998 UP model. Uh, now you can see we are underneath my garage uh, with the fluorescent tube and both soft boxes so that at least we'll get some good, good footage and at least it'll be lit up properly and I'll be able to see where all the dirty, scratchy, uneven parts of the roof are. Now, um, on my lovely table behind me, I have uh, my cutting compound, my polishing compound, uh, some rust kill, because I think there might be a little bit up there up in the roof, the roof rails, um, the enamel polish, or the enamel black gloss, the primer, some uh, masking tape, some sandpaper, and a piece of paper, some cloths, and uh, I think that should really do us for the time being. So, as you can see, the camera stand's already all set up, ready for us to go. So, let's get on with it. Now there was one little thing I forgot to mention. This is a, uh, a metal roof and directly above it is the sun beating down on top of it. That's why we're actually underneath cover today because it's so hot. Um, although the weather man said it's supposed to rain this weekend. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah, blame it on the weather man. Maybe somebody should write a song about it. Um, so even though we're under cover, it is sweltering hot. Um, so especially when we're this close to the roof. So, well, if you see the sweat pouring down out of my face, it's not because I'm crying, it's because I'm sweating like crazy. So, I've just finished sanding and scrubbing these two sections back with a wire brush and scraper to get rid of all of the surface rust. Uh, these two over here I did a little earlier. I have treated them with rust kill, so that's why they've changed a little bit of a colour. So I'm now about to uh, do a uh, part on these two and uh, treat them with rust kill. So let's have a look at that. So it says to uh, leave this stuff on for about uh, 20, uh, 15 to 20 minutes. Let's pour a bit in there, pour a bit in there, and we'll just wipe it around into all the holes where all the rust is, and we'll leave it. It's supposed to convert the rust. So we'll find out how it goes. So it's been approximately uh, 30 minutes since these two have been done. These ones have been about uh, 40, 40 minutes. Now I'm going to give them a quick uh, once over again, scrape them back, give them a quick sand, and then treat them again just to make sure that I get rid of all of that rust uh, before I hit the primer on it. So I've just finished treating these two here with the second coat, so I scrape them back again, clean them up even more, and uh, then just have just treated them with the uh, the rust kill again. So we'll leave them for another uh, 15 to uh, 30 minutes, and we'll come back and uh, give them another check over. So I just finished doing the uh, the other side of these. So this one here, this is the second one, and the other, this one here. Those ones there are the ones I just I just finished uh, putting the second coat of the rust kill on. So these two here, we'll put the uh, second coat of the rust coat on and uh, leave it for uh, 15 to 30 minutes. So I've just finished wiping these down with uh, water, as it said to. 
next step is to uh, wipe it down with uh, methylated spirits. Um, that's what I'm doing now. Taking off all of the water and any extra residue. As you can see, they're a hell of a lot better now. So I'll take, uh, take some photos and uh, show you a little bit closer. Cutting the uh, roof back with uh, the cutting compound. We've taken out the, uh, the surface rust that was up the front on the uh, on the roof rails. Um, what else have we done? We killed the rust. Um, we've uh, sanded it back, ready to be primed. Uh, what else? Well, in between all that, uh, had a visit from Mum. And yeah, it's been a very very productive day. But uh, we won't get uh, the rest of the car cut and polished today. Um, I was was hoping to get out uh, the, 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 uh, the new buffing machine um, and, um, and give the car a buff. Until then, if you liked anything you've seen in these, these videos, give us a big thumbs up and like this video. Uh, don't forget to uh, leave any comments in the part below, anything that I can be doing better, any questions of uh, what I've actually done, what I've used. Uh, what's another thing? Oh, that's right, subscribe to my channel. I need as many subscribers as possible. At the moment on YouTube I only have five subscribers, come on guys, I'm pretty sure I have a lot more than just five friends out there. Uh, so get on, subscribe, and get notified for this type of video and all the other type of videos that I do. I do unboxing, cooking with Cray, car maintenance, and like today, today's daily vlog. Um, until then, see you in the next video.